guys, and welcome back to part 4 of the 4 Immortal Sisters Challenge. And I am so sorry to keep you guys waiting on the next part, but I just haven't gotten around to it until now, and I'm really happy to be back. So, everyone is just kind of doing their own thing today, and of course, in the last part, Seraphine... Uh, we found out Seraphine is pregnant, and she has such a giant belly. And I guess uh, Austin is going home already. But she is reading a mixology book to kind of get her mix mixology skill up. What is Meredith doing? And a friend is just watering the plants, you know, doing her thing. And today, actually, we are going to go back to the uh, Oasis Springs Park and fish for a cow plant seed because I know where to find it now. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do that. Probably when she is done doing that, we can go ahead and head over there. Um I'm forgetting their names here, Vids, but um Amelia is just practicing her violin and a good thing because she is she doesn't sound too good at all. So yeah, everyone's just kind of chilling. Meredith is just here taking in this beautiful day today and I also wanted to clear things up a bit about uh, the whole pregnancy thing so I think after Seraphine has four births she gives like four births I don't know why it's so hard for me to pronounce the word birth but it is anyways um, yeah I think after she has four babies or it could be three I'm not too sure that's when another sister can go ahead and have a baby but after that I think it just hap the cycle has to happen again so you know um, Seraphine can have four children and then after that any one of the sisters can have their own children but then after that you know we have to go back to Seraphine and have four more before any of the other sisters can get pregnant again. So yeah, that's how things work out. And I know some of you guys were confused about that. So I just wanted to clear things up a bit here. And Meredith is dancing. They love to dance, these sims, they do. <laughs> they love it. I actually was gonna have Meredith and let's go ahead and play with Amelia. Amelia can go ahead and stop her violin practice. They can play a little bit of chess together. I think that would be nice. And Fern is just throwing some punches here. I, and a lot of you guys have been saying how Fern looks like the Earth Sim and Amelia looks like the... Uh, no, that Amelia would look like the Earth Sim and that Fern looks like the Air Sim. And I guess they kind of do now that you guys have pointed it out. But for Amelia, I was kind of going for like a bell look from Beauty and the Beast. I don't know. And... I feel like she would be someone who likes to read and is creative and to me she has that appearance so that's why I gave her that and she's the air sim so and Fern is the earth sim and I think she quite matches the role well so yeah. And what is Seraphine doing here? Did she advance in her mixology skill? I'm not too sure. Where do we find this crap? <laughs> uh, okay, here we go. Mixology level one. No, you should keep reading. Um, where did the book go? Where did you leave the book? Or is it this? No. I don't know where she left the book at. Oh, right here. Mixology. There's like just a ton of books here. Okay, let's go ahead and put away all of these books. Actually, let's keep the mixology one out there. Why is she feeling tense? Oh, because she has the whole Sims that hate children and feel a little uneasy about pregnancy. She has stressful decor. Oh, I wonder why. But I think we're gonna go ahead and have Fern. Whoa, she has a ton of stuff in her inventory. I just realized. All right, so most of this stuff we can go ahead and put in the fridge. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. What is this? A rock? Okay, we'll put this fish in there or yeah it's not really worth much we can't put it in there why okay I guess we'll just sell it will you put that in there yeah well I guess we should sell some mushrooms I mean to get some profit and then we'll put the carrots in there and we have a guppy we'll sell the guppy 
And it looks like we have a time capsule. We have two of them, so let's go ahead and open those up. And, of course, they are some My Sims trophies and... What's the other one? Open this one up, too. Where'd it go? That's weird. Didn't we have... Oh, okay, we got the same one. Wow, that's convenient, so... I guess we can go ahead and sell one of these. No, let's go ahead and... Okay, let's do that. Oh, we sold... I didn't want to sell both of them. Alright, this is what I have to deal with. Anyways, let's go ahead and head to the park so we can go ahead and fish for some cow plant seeds, I believe. So, isn't that Austin? Yeah, why did- he was mad. <laughs> I guess he's not in the greatest mood ever after finding out that he impregnated Seraphine. I don't know. Maybe. Well, let's go ahead and go to the Desert Plume- Desert Bloom Park. I think I said Desert Plume, which I don't even know if that's a word, but- yeah, so I figured out that the kind of the little pondish place next to like really high in the mountains, which I sh I will show you guys right now, but that is where we need to fish in order to find the cow plant seeds. So yeah, this is super exciting because yeah, we need those cow plants and I also think they take a while to grow, so you know, the faster we can get them, the better off we'll be. Well, this chick has some Super bright purple hair. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and find the little pond here, which is up here. It's this. It's this one right here. So yeah, it's kind of hidden up here in the mountains, but yeah, this is where we need to go ahead and fish. So let's go ahead and go fishing. And it is just so pretty here. I love it. Alright. Anytime now, she'll get here. Alright, she's here. And she's in her workout attire. Alright, so cross your fingers, you guys. We need to find some cow plant seeds. And I'll probably fast forward here a bit and get back when there's some sort of activity because... Honestly, she's not doing much, so. Who's this chick? Elena Thorne? What does she look like? I always like looking at the Sims in this town. Oh, and she reached le le fishing level 3. She's kind of cute, actually. I like her little gardener outfit. But yeah, anyways, I will get back when something eventful happens, I suppose. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so we found one. We found a cow plant berry, a plantable, strangely bovine fruit. Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. So it really didn't take us long, honestly. Uh, I think I'm going to have her fish for a little more to see if she can find some more because we do need at least four for each of the sisters. So yeah, we're going to just hang out here a bit until maybe we find another one. And yeah, but even though super exciting we accomplished what we needed to do so yes all right so it's like six o'clock so i think i'm gonna have her head home because she is getting a bit hungry and no we didn't we didn't find another one but that's okay we found one so you know we we at least found something um but yeah let's go ahead and have her go home now i bet she's really tired with all of that fishing and yeah we need to check up on the sisters because we kind of left them at home for a while so yeah there's quite a few sims at the park actually today so nice alrighty so we are home and let's go ahead and check up on the sisters here okay so Seraphine is incredibly tense how can we help that we can have her take a shower all right and what do we need to do uh showers and baths will help calm Seraphine and elevate stress so I guess taking a brisk shower? I don't know how a shower helps, but it says to take a shower, so we will go ahead and do that. And what about everyone else here? Amelia? She, Amelia really likes to go into her sister's room and have some drinks. Uh, I'm not even going to question her, but 
She wants to share ideas. It looks like they're pretty good. They've managed to hold themselves up well. Um, I'll go ahead and have... Uh, I don't know, whatever. They can do whatever they want. But we need to have Fern eat something because she's really hungry. Maybe she can have some... BLT. We'll have her grab a serving. No, not cake. I don't think cake would be the best idea after a workout. <laughs> I mean, personally, but yeah. Alrighty, and yeah, we're gonna have to plant this cow plant. And I believe you can just plant them. Well, you have to plant them just like kind of on the ground. Yeah, so we'll probably plant them over here next to this tree. I don't think anyone would attempt to steal them. Hopefully not. This house is really beautiful. It's way better than my little build building <laughs> that I built. Uh, but, uh, alright. Maybe Amelia, what is Amelia doing? Oh, okay, yeah. She needs to use the restroom. Seraphine is just, she wants to vent to someone. Okay, where's Meredith? You can go vet to Meredith. Oh my gosh, why are you- this wall? Okay. Go ahead and vent, complain about your problems because apparently you have a lot on your shoulders right now. <laughs> let's get back to Fern. Um, let's go ahead and have Amelia clean this up because she's the one who brought the free freaking drink over here. And we'll go ahead and have- oh. Fern needs to take a shower. Take a speedy shower. And we'll have her plant the cow plant. So that thing can get growing. Because they do take a while to grow. And yeah, we need a plant. It looks so weird. But you can kind of see that it's a cow plant. Because at least I can tell. That's so cool though. <laughs> This, this will be the first time that I have a cow plant in The Sims 4. Because I don't think we had any, any in The Sims 3, so... Yeah, no. Okay, Amelia, what are you doing? Did she go to work today? She... Yeah, she does. She had no work today, but... We'll go ahead, we'll go ahead and have her come back and practice her violin. Uh, what are the girls doing? They're just talking to each other. Is it um Seraphine getting so big? Um, tell a funny story. Can Seraphine announce the news to her? Share big news. Oh, okay. We'll break it to Meredith, even though I mean, obviously she probably already noticed. <laughs> I guess we could go ahead and have Fern. Oh, she already planted it. Wow, like, I, I had put it over here purposefully, but no, we had to go ahead and move it. <laughs> what does this say? This galactic marvel makes an excellent source of food, cuddles, and lifelong friendship. Become the envy of the neighborhood. Just remember to feed it. Alright, so we'll go ahead and water it. What is this? She wants to weed a plant, go for a jog, do push-ups. She's feeling very energetic today. Isn't she super cute? All of the sisters are really cute, but I don't know. I really like Fern. She's adorable. Um, okay, let's go ahead and check out our garden, which is doing rather well. I'm very proud of myself. <laughs> um, yeah, it's doing pretty good. All right, so she can go ahead. Oh, she, she wants to socialize a bit, a bit. So let's go ahead and join our sisters. Talk to them a bit. Amelia's kind of the, the lonely type. <laughs> yeah, she is a bit of a loner, so she's up here practicing her violin. I'd probably be most similar to Amelia because her traits are very... something that I would have. And I actually took like this quiz, which most of the quizzes online, you know, aren't all of that 100% accurate, but I did get... It was like a four elements quiz and like what element you were and I got air, so yeah. I'd be more similar to Amelia. What would you guys be? You guys should totally find out. I think it's cool anyways. <laughs> um, she's kind of tired, so we'll go ahead and have her go, go ahead and go to sleep. And 
the sisters are all here together talking. I didn't want to have Seraphine actually this is reveal a deep secret. And I wanted her to feel her tummy, if that's an option. Oh, I don't know. But she's pretty tired as well, so we'll go, we'll get we'll go ahead and have her go to sleep as well. And she has the most comfy bed ever because she has this giant bed all to herself, which, honestly, big beds for yourself is the best thing ever. Honestly. <laughs> or probably that's what lonely people say, you know? Yeah, that too. <laughs> Alright, and Meredith and Fern. Everyone's pretty tired, and Fern needs to use the restroom, so let's go ahead and have her do that. We'll go ahead and have everyone go to sleep now. Uh, yeah, so that was a pretty... Yeah, we did. We found a cow plant, which is what I wanted to do in this part, so yeah. But I think I will get back in the morning when everyone is awake. Alright, guys, so everyone is pretty much awake, and Seraphine is ha has a bigger belly today. Um... Yeah, she's popping, and <laughs> she is still very tenseful about her pregnancy. And yeah, Meredith is cooking up some breakfast because uh, she doesn't really like getting leftovers since, you know, she likes cooking and eating fresh food. So she's making herself some pancakes. And Fern, I believe, is working on her logic skill. And everyone woke up pretty early today. It's like 4 in the morning and they're kind of crazy if you ask me because I am in no way a early riser. I hate waking up like early in the mornings and yeah, that's that's me. <laughs> so what are they doing? They're just chatting, having a good time. But, uh, Amelia does want to read a book, so we'll get everyone to do their thing. And, uh, what does she want to do? She wants to dance the stereo music, meet someone new, kiss someone. I think she is kind of missing Austin. <laughs> Which, I, will, I, I wouldn't blame her, but what can I have her do, actually? She can go ahead and watch some TV, watch some romance. Call someone on the phone, buy a toy. Uh, we'll have Meredith clean these plates up. I left them purposefully so that she could clean them up. Because she is, of course, the cooker and cleaner of the house. Which is pretty awesome. I mean, like, that would be a pretty good deal if, you know, you had to live your you had to live with your sister for the rest of your life and she kind of did everything for you. That would be cool. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and check on our garden today. I don't think much has changed. They're all pretty good. And our cow plant is on the other side. So let's go ahead and check him. Because he's probably the most important thing right now. Doesn't he look... <laughs> you can just see like the little horns coming out. That is so cool. So, so cool. Um, let's go ahead and have our fish. Practice her fishing. We can fish with bait today. Ooh. Oh my gosh. You can fish. You can. Other fish is bait for fish. And I just thought I was playing around. But all of it are foul. The freshness is foul. I don't think they would like it. So. I didn't know we had to keep fish in a certain type of. Alright, I guess we can just go ahead and sell all of them. Well, that one was worth 32 simoleons. Nice. And these rocks, 150. Wow. Alright, but yeah, let's go, just go have our fishing. Go fishing, and um, apparently everyone left like hot dogs here. And they're spoiled. That's gross. <laughs> thanks, thanks a lot for keeping the environment super duper nice <laughs> what is everyone doing here <laughs> what is up with the seraphine she wants to take a bath do we even have a bathtub yeah i think she has one in her 
in her bathroom. What is this? Oh, okay. Seraphine's room is over here. Uh, yeah, she has a bathtub. She can go ahead and take a bath. Um, we'll take a bubble bath. That sounds really relaxing. Oh, look at the trolley. I wish it was like we were able. Oh my god. <laughs> this is totally real life, you guys, right? You like. Mortimer just went through the trolley. Yeah. I so wish we could, like, go inside and use it, though. But it's so cute, even though, at least, it gives a nice background. Okay, you can stop playing chess. Amelia is reading, and I think she goes to work today, so... She works in five hours. Awesome. Meredith is usually the one that I have nothing for her to do. <laughs> but soon enough, she'll be busy with the Seraphine's baby. Um, she wants to write jokes for an hour. Okay. We can do that. <laughs> if she wants to do that. While we'll we write jokes. Ooh. I didn't know it got you in the flirty mood. Oh, because she watched, watched a romantic comedy. The flirtatious inclinations are strong after viewing that steamy romance. Pretty tasty food. And feeling great. A well cared for sim is a happy sim. I think anyone who takes a bubble bath is pretty much happy. <laughs> That's so cool, like how she was just reading in the kitchen and she saw Meredith come over here, so like she started reading here with her. <laughs> I think that is so cool. Um, she's sitting in the little kid desk, which she actually fits pretty well in. I thought she'd fit kind of big in, but no, she's pretty good. <laughs> so she just ditched the book. She wanted to chat with Meredith. Fern is just fishing. I guess we should have her go and search for some more cow plant seeds, but yeah, we'll have her eat something before she goes. And I could always just take her there and leave her there fishing, but I'm not too sure if if I would leave her there and she would just continue fishing on her own. Um, I don't know, but she needs to eat. We'll have her eat. Some chocolate cake, why not? That sounds really good. I love cake. I'm a huge fan of cake. And then chocolate is like my favorite, so. I love cake. <laughs> and d who else has a job? Doesn't one of the other sisters have a job? Oh, I guess not. I guess Amelia is the only one, only one with the job today. Okay, we can go ahead and stop fishing now. What are you doing, girl? I told you to come eat, and you didn't come and eat. Come eat your chocolate cake. Amelia, get out of the way. That's probably why she's not coming. Go ahead and have yourself some chocolate cake. Alrighty. It is 8 a.m. She's feeling quite playful. Bubbles! There are a few things in a sim's life that can be fixed, that can't be fixed with bubbles. So true. Oh my god, look at her. Oh, can Amelia feel her belly now? I don't know. She probably can. Where is Fern? My god. No. Okay. She decided to grill some hot dogs. Okay, just continue. Resume grilling them. Those look pretty good. There's like nowhere to put them down. Okay, eat a hot dog. And let me just check up. Oh, Austin is here! Oh, he wants to see Seraphine. That is so cute. Okay, we should invite him inside. Invite in. That is so adorable. Amelia, you really need to get out of those PJs. Just just saying, girl. Just saying. Um, I'm, I'm not sure if she can learn the logic skill. Can she? I think she can, actually. <laughs> what am I thinking? Let's go ahead and have her play. And... Okay. Aw, she went out. She went out to talk with Austin. Oh, okay, let's go ahead and... 
We need to share the big news with him. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. I wonder how he's gonna react. I don't think he knows. No beam. Shorg. Oh my god. I hate this. Sims still have routing issues in The Sims 4. Okay. Can we share the big news now? Oh my god. <laughs> this is so annoying. Okay. Let's go ahead and put this away. Hopefully Austin walks away from there because we can't seem to talk to him when he's standing right there. Are you going to move or not? Okay. Tell a funny story. Oh my god. Okay. Let's go ahead and try to talk to him now. We can't. We can't seem to talk to him. Oh my god. Um, we're kind of stuck. <laughs> I don't know where to go. If he would just move, that would be great. I don't even know. I'm going to stop now, but I think this is where I'm going to end the... Okay, good. Okay, at least I can, before I end this part, I can go ahead and share the news. I can go ahead and share the news with him. Okay, was that seriously too hard? It wasn't. Oh my god! <gasps> He's crying! What the hell? Okay, he did not want a baby. Wow. I kind of just want to break up with him right now. How dare he? I'm gonna do it. We're gonna... We're gonna give him the cold shoulder. Like, seriously. We announced our pregnancy to you, and... You're not happy about it? Well, he hates children. Oh, that's probably why. And we hate children, too. But still! Still! My gosh, like... <laughs> I don't know. We are, we're gonna have to end up... Breaking up with him anyway, so might as well... Might as well start something with him. <laughs> we're gonna criticize his woohoo techniques. And <laughs> we're so mean. We'll go ahead and brush him off. Like, seriously. And... What else? Can we just break up with him? How do we do that? Um, ask to move in? No, that's not what we want to do. Aw, invite to feel baby. He's just not feeling it, though, like. How do we break up with him? Or, yeah, how do we just become friends? Because right now we are sweethearts and lovebirds. How do we... Mean? Give the cold shoulder, imply jeer. <laughs> what does jeer mean? I don't even know what that means. Mischief. What about romance? Apologize in bed. Ooh! I kind of want to do that just to do that. We're going to do that. <laughs> that is so hilarious. Did he like it? Oh, no, he didn't. I think he rejected us. <laughs> He's like, no thanks. Okay, whatever. We won't. You missed the opportunity. You didn't want You didn't want this. Mm -mm. <laughs> Let's go ahead and just break up with him if... I mean, we're not dating, but... I don't know. Let's just be mean to him. Yell at him. <laughs> we're just emotional. We're a pregnant emotional lady, okay? That is what Seraphine is right now. We'll give him the cold shoulder. We'll just be terribly mean to him. But I think this is where I'm going to end the part here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And in the next part, we'll have Fern go back and fish for some more cow plant seeds. And uh, yeah, so I will talk to you guys all in my very next video. Bye, guys.